November 2008, paper one, question number six. Ikulmangi graph, kune graph e kona e vezo alapana. It a boy stands at the edge of a high cliff. So here we see a boy standing at the edge of a high cliff. Standing at the edge of a high cliff. And the, he throws, this boy throws a stone vertically upwards with an initial velocity of 10 meters per second. So he throws a stone vertically upwards with an initial velocity. Vi is 10 meters per second. What are from the graph? Siabona Oguti. It's positive, which means it color from positive axis. Shot Vi or plus 10. So, which means upwards is positive. Upwards is positive, while downwards downwards is negative. So this man throws a, a boy stands standing at the edge of a high cliff. He throws a stone vertically upwards with an initial velocity of 10 meters per second. The stone strikes the ground at the point below the cliff after 3,5 seconds. Oh! Which means each Eliepezulu Labuya Lazulayushaya Lapati Kwaitata a total time which means delta T for the whole trip for the whole trip is trip is 3,5 seconds. So it took 3,5 seconds for the stone to reach the lower part of a cliff, that the lower part of the cliff, Lapana part. So now they say the velocity time graph below was obtained from measurement during or made during the motion of the stone. So the velocity time graph, it was that use the information on the graph to, to answer the following question. Use the information on the graph. Now, this way, Palamina, Ogba Legi Lek Pela Gule Graph, Ugu Zengwa Zwi Taza. Si Abona La, in velocity, velocity in meters per second. So we have uh, time in seconds. Time in seconds. We are having Imeganji is a Yopelala. Lana is cut to one second and then is from ten. So, Loya two seconds, Uhabisana no minus ten, a two seconds, or three seconds. Oh, three seconds, three seconds, oh, Habisana, eating it from Sana, no minus fifteen, minus fifteen. So we have, then we have zero comma five seconds, zero comma five, we graph. Ila apo, kuboni ya mbuga, kabanguti ila mina ganti la apo, la apo ba wetu, minus 25. So, 3,5. Now, we have something of this nature. Now, they say use the information on the graph to answer the following questions. Passivity number one, calculate the acceleration of the stone between the time of two seconds and three seconds. The acceleration of the stone between the time of two seconds and the time of three seconds. 
what is the acceleration of the stone? Kamanya must be a gradient of the graph between time of two and time of three. So the gradient, the gradient is delta v over delta t. So we have uh, v v two minus v one. Go by seven graph. We don't use the equation of motion over t two minus t one. Now, what is v two between the time of two and v two? The final velocity a corner is minus fifteen, which is minus fifteen minus into. Isuga go p v one a corner. Isuga go minus ten. Sir. He says, yeah, five, five seconds. Yeah, it's right. He says, yeah, five seconds. 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 He says, uh, Sefuna a velocity uh, but between two seconds and three seconds. All right, sure. So, Bafuna a velocity between two seconds now, two seconds and three seconds. So, Sefuna velocity from uh, minus 10 to minus 15. So, the learning of a snake gradient here graph, the acceleration uh, we tell a weak gradient of a velocity time. So, if you have a portion of gradient of velocity time. In fact, Ms. Bugala, but it's calculated the acceleration of but equation now. Uh, calculate the acceleration of the stone between the times of two seconds and three seconds. So acceleration is known as a gradient of the graph. So the gradient of a velocity time graph is delta V over delta T. What is delta V? It's V2 minus V1 over T2 minus T1. Now what is V2? The velocity of the The final is minus 20, which is minus 20 minus into is so the velocity of the is the minus plus this portion. So you minus 20. Is so the velocity of the V1 way to minus 10. So minus 20 minus minus 10 over is cut. Is the cut is the 3. Is so the cut is 2. So we have 3 minus 2. So minus uh, 20 minus minus 10, which is minus 10, because minus 20 minus minus 10, uh, which is plus 10, which is minus 10 over 1, which is minus 10 meters per second squared. So it's 10 meters per second squared downwards. Yeah, when I get downwards, it's negative. So vel acceleration here too is downwards. It's always downwards in my object. We section of a projectile motion. At which time or times is the stone moving at five meters per second? At which time? Or times now, O5 way to good graph here to a coincider no zero comma five a forty O5 way to colomony graph minus five a coincider no quick graph here to a hamisana no one comma five so which is one comma five. So they are talking here of the speed, but at which time 
is uh, is the stone moving at the speed of five. So masculine man, the speed of five, as an direction, as an go to positive or negative. As it pegile, is it pege in magnitude of the speed. We should the speed is a scalar, so which is five meters per second. So but the time or times. So ngibona mama slapa out two, which means it e cut is two. Gobama max out two. Kumelin check it cut is two. So it's cut so kala with zero comma five seconds, it's to be hambang a velocity of five. It's cut as bili, it's to be hambang a velocity of five, cut at what? At one comma five seconds. So the time is zero comma five and one comma five seconds. Let's say it is six point three. How many seconds does the stone reach its highest point? How many seconds? Does the stone reach its highest point? Highest point, one second. So it reaches its highest point after one second. 6.4. Determine the height of the cliff from which the stone was thrown. The height of the cliff from which the stone was thrown. Mm. Now, a height of a cliff. A total displacement. So, the height of a cliff is a total displacement. The height of a cliff is a total displacement. The height of a cliff is a total displacement. Mese itoli lele ifiga la pana pa anti le pa anti besa si mainaza le ya height ya la pana so agus mo ne kala uguti tini now lana agus pere u u delta y wa e e e higher delta y ya le grafle we call it x y z as for new delta y yellow delta y is half base times height so it is half what is the base it's one what is the height is 10 so which is five meters plus five okay since you want to get over to from a lag at the e corner yeah and the five meters we are present all right says we are Sisi buya la lazi ya kanta elana la kushuguti lana ili skati buya la gyo so ya hamba plus five asi 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 tate or sisi soti so shaya yonke le mese si maina za lapana then that will give us the height of the now we have let's get the total yala triangle Z K P triangle Z K P. So delta Y uh, uh, downwards. So lana be schoolman go upwards. Now I guess pege go downwards. Downwards. Sina nina delta Y is it's. Its area of a triangle Z K P, which is area, which is half base times height. Half. What is the base? It's in I base here too. It's from one up to three, which is two. Half of two times what is the height from there up to there is 25 times 25 25 half of 2 it's 1 1 times 25 25 meters oh now minus 25 what is y total Sizotinina y total e hambe plus five meters yase ibuya hamba minus twenty-five meters. 
so plus 5 minus 25 so which is minus uh, 20 meters minus 20 meters calculate the height of the cliff from which the stone was thrown the height of the cliff from which the stone was thrown so the height of the cliff the height from the ground we are the height of the cliff from the ground it's plus 20 meters so it's 20 meters up and it's your name plus 55 yeah we are number minus 25 see a pants like a little code what am i just fully height like sugar lap up to like sugar code so so we have instead of sitting minus 20 then it will be plus because the height is from the ground we are pezuri and we know that upwards is positive so we have we have that Mesa it is 6.5 using the top of the cliff as the initial position of the stone sketch the position time graph for the motion of the stone from its highest point until it reaches the ground using the top of the cliff as the initial position of the stone okay initial position so from here we're talking here of zero as the initial position of the stone now but he, let us draw a graph of a displacement against time so but he calculate or draw using the top of the cliff as the position of the stone sketch the position time graph for the motion of the stone from its highest point oh at its highest point one second from one second where it was at its highest point See, to look at its highest point, it was 5 meters. Oh, which means from 5 meters. 5 meters after 1 second from here. After 1 second. Yes. 1 second from its highest point, 5 meters. Yeah. See, as we see, after 1 second, uh, E accelerate le ya ze abuela ku zero e accelerate le ya ze abuela ku zero e accelerate le eh e accelerate le abuela ku zero we velocity akona u 10 so ko itata another so here we have two all right we have two then but from its highest point until it reaches the ground so it a accelerator it in it is from its highest point shooting accelerator as a wheel of zero as a lapana so we have we have what we have 3.5 so, I am Bagangina, yes, a cubega, yes, niggas a cave, pillar, I guess he cave a pillar, yes, a manatibuti, sibe bache, ibe, even a cave, okay. So, in Gaganani, it is placement ya conana, sitella, oh, oh, minus, eh, oh, minus. 20 so displacement is zero it's minus 20 so we have something of that nature so but he only indicate the relevant time values on the x-axis minage gisuwe nga hamba pambili nga faga nalo kwe nga buzwa nga kona nga oba pela nisabi luto these are the relevant time values one second it was five meters above your accelerator your displacement to zero with at one second which is a total of two seconds that is sugar up here yeah figure at the time of three comma five seconds so that's is 20 
uh, meters. So we have we have that uh, problem. So says the access criteria and the problem uh, uh, projectile motion, uh, projectile motion.